Welcome back to Zuri Crypto Journal. Today we're going to talk about uh, another update on an airdrop of MetaMask. As you might know, MetaMask is one of the widely most used wallets with more than 30 million users around the world. And since its launch in 2016, MetaMask has left everyone waiting for an airdrop and for a token. If you're already a fan of this wallet, you will like to hear what I'm going to tell you during this video. And I will help you to position yourself in order to get the airdrop. So I know that because Consensus CEO has announced publicly that they're going to release a token. But this is only the beginning. They are also launching a DAO or a, an autonomous organization. And the name of the CEO is Joseph Lubing and he left us with a tweet that he doesn't say too much, but he says something interesting, which is that the name of the token, the, the symbol of the token will be Musk. Anyway, you have also to consider there are more than 30 million users around the world, so it's unlikely that they're going to airdrop everyone or every user. So we are going to have to make something in order to be eligible for this airdrop. So here there are some of the steps uh, that you can take in order to uh, get more chances to be eligible for this airdrop. First of all, you can start to interact with some of the most popular Ethereum dApps with your wallets. For example, Uniswap, SushiSwap, Curve, Aave, Lido, Balancer, and etc. So basically, on chain activity, including depositing FANG, doing on chain transactions, interacting with dApps, and signing, uh, let's say, some transactions that are also governance side of some protocols, they are all going to increase your chance to be eligible for an airdrop. Another step I will take is to swap ERC20 on MetaMask directly. So you will be able to swap between tokens and they will generate some fees as well, but also some interactions that are going to be on-chain, so they're going to be eligible for you. They're going to be help you to be eligible for an airdrop. What you can do, you can also use the built-in uh, feature in the app, and uh, my recommendation is to swap Ethereum network tokens, so tokens that are ERC20. They are going to be more expensive to swap because they are fees that are connected with the layer 2 of Ethereum, but it's highly recommended because also consensus which is the company behind MetaMask, is investing hardly on Ethereum. So I think they're going to recommend and they're going to give back <clears throat> some funds and rewards and airdrops to the people that interacted with the Ethereum Layer 1. Another thing you can do is to utilize the MetaMask Bridge, which is a built-in function and it allows you to move from one blockchain to another. What you can do is to move funds from, for example, the Ethereum network to, let's say, another network that you need to interact with, like Polygon, for example. But other blockchains that are also supported are BNB, Avalanche, and so on. So in order to prepare for an airdrop, you should uh, read about the information that you can find on Twitter, for example, if they have a Twitter, how many followers, how much do they interact, do they have partnership, then you will have also to read the white paper. So usually they will have um, a white paper where they can say also about the project, the tokenomics. So tokenomics is also how many tokens are going to be released. And you can check also other projects and all the history and the team behind this project. So this research is something you should do on yourself. You should start to uh, research a bit about it. But of course, consensus is very well known. Uh, MetaMask is the widely most adopted wallet in crypto, 30 plus million users in the world. So I will say that this is a safe bet from my point of view, but do your own research as usual. Always to ensure that the project is legit and that it is committed on delivering on its promises. Now, in terms of token allocation, MetaMask is supposed to give 5% of their total supply in order for uh, be released for an airdrop. This seems in line with other projects for also the community expectations. So I hope this gave you uh, an overview, a very simple overview on how to be uh, have more chances to get this airdrop. It's gonna come soon. I don't know when, nobody knows, but it's gonna be announced. <clears throat> and you're gonna see some tokens on your wallet in case you're interacting a lot with uh, blockchains and so on. So I hope this video helped you. Thank you for watching and see you in the next episode of the Recrypto Journal.